This is a demonstration video of the Danset Conquest record player. I'm just going to show you how to use it so that you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. When you receive it, the first thing you may want to do is to fit the optional legs which simply screw into the plates on the bottom of the machine. When you lift the lid, the first thing you'll need to do is to screw down the two transit screws here and here and screw those all the way down fully clockwise so that the deck floats on its springs. Also unclip the arm. The three main controls are on the front and are clearly marked for on off, volume, treble and bass. On the deck the speed dial is on the left and start stop on the right and size detection is automatic. So you can load between one and eight records, I'll demonstrate with two, just so that you can see how it plays. So just pop the records onto the spindle ledge and put the stacker arm across, select the appropriate speed and to start the auto changer flick the right hand control knob all the way around. And if you want to skip to the next record, just flick the right hand control knob all the way around again. Once upon a time so I'll just demonstrate with the start of a 12 inch record as well. When you stack a 10 or 12 inch record, the black horizontal lever at the back is the size detection system. So you need to make sure the record is stacked above the black lever like so. And that is so that the playing arm knows to land in the correct position. the arm lifts off automatically when it reaches the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and you just want to play one record manually you can just pop an individual record down the spindle onto the mat and select the first option on the right hand dial manual and that will start the turntable turning and you can then place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing carefully lower the stacker arm down so it knows to switch off automatically at the end of play. If you leave it running with the stacker bar left in the upright position like so, that will trigger the repeat function, which is for 7 inch records only, and it will replay the same 7 inch over again until manually switched off. If you do want to play 78s, there is a dedicated 78 stylus, simply flip over like so. So I hope that covers everything for you, but if you do have any questions when you receive it, I'll include my personal email address in with the machine and please use that method to contact me.